Hello guys, welcome back to Lego's Island. It is Wednesday, March 8th of 2023, and this is the four-year anniversary day of the dog park, which um, you can thank Go Get 33 uh, four years ago for recommending this to me, like right after Operation Wilderness. And in uh, favor of that, where the heck is he? We do have cake, and yeah, she'll be needed today anyway, regardless. Ah! There he is! Yeah. Anyway, let's jump into it. Let's see which... Well, actually, since this is an event tour, let's see which dog we get. Okay, so we technically did get Cake, but we also got Steven. Okay, we already have Cake with us, considering, again, it's an anniversary. But Steven will work. Although it will not matter, considering we're just going to be in the dog park the whole time to begin with. So that was basically pointless. But I'll still grab them anyway. Welcome to the dog park 4th anniversary. You gotta be kidding me, I never made a hat. Yep, I only just realized right now. One sec. See, told you it wouldn't take long. The dog park 4th anniversary hat. Let's put it on. And I just dropped it. Where the frick did that go? I guess we'll collect it again. Unless we already have it in here. Nope. We're gonna have to collect it again. Take off that anniversary hat for the event room. And this is how it looks. It looks pretty beautiful. I think it may look similar to a previous hat, but hey. If you're genuinely curious, and yes, before you ask. There you go. Um, like, it relates to the theme of these four colors. And let's grab Steven, despite us being here the entire time. So, genuinely, what was even the point of even going up to the balcony in the first place? Speaking of which, can you even see it from here? Nope! Not unless you're really close. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Alright, no, seriously though, let's actually, you know, uh, I'm getting to actual realness here. As you guys can see, the dog park is obviously decorative for the 4th anniversary. For only one day. Of course. Anyway. Yeah. With that being said, uh, I chose these four colors because, well, they're probably the most related to the dog park. Of course, we had to make the four out of bone. Again, I think this is actually, I think, tradition since the first one. You know, now that I think about it, it makes me now want to go rewatch the previous Doc Park anniversaries. You know, that's kind of a thing now for some reason for all of these. Now it makes me want to go watch the previous ones to see how different they looked. Anyway, again, that is obviously the only free item as usual because it's just a one day mini event. Anyway, what are your thoughts on the colors, by the way, for this party? They do look really pretty, honestly. And this doesn't really look as, like, the layout doesn't look as different as compared to the previous year. I think this has always stayed the same, like, just the dog park layout. Of course, the only difference basically nowadays is, of course, obviously we've had more dogs. Oh, well, yeah, the layout has definitely changed a bit. We didn't have Shamrock, Cake, uh, Turkey, or Res. Which, by the way, you do see another tent being constructed for the upcoming Pi Day dog on Pi Day itself, March 14th. This is the first time I'm doing that. And, hey, why not? I have to do something different in this anniversary party. I mean, the only reason last year's was so different was because of the layout change. Yeah, that's that. Yeah, that's the only reason last year's was so different was because again of the layout change. Now you may notice for each tent there are four cakes on each tent, making a reference to four years. That also can explain why the streamers are having four colors on them. Again, another reference to four years. Back to the point, though. That's what I'd make out those two references. So yeah. Comment down below if you've managed to notice that. I know, this looks beautiful. And that's really sweet. 
So moving on here, yep, that's basically what we got. Yeah, but just four cakes on each tent. Some of them are even placed somewhat differently. Like some of them aren't even, you know, in the front here. Some of them are actually quite literally in the back of the tents. Either because I couldn't fit them in the middle. Either because the dog was in the way. I know I could have pushed them, but you know what? Maybe it is for the better. Maybe we have to finally change things up after all this time. Anyway, point is... I, I still hope you guys love the little uh, thing I did where I put four cakes on every tent as a little reference to the four year anniversary. But yep, that's pretty sweet, right? I'm not showing these for too long considering you get the point now. But obviously, one thing that is obviously, you know, attention to detail here is that obviously the co respective colored candle is... You know, they are on top of the respective colored flat um, tent. Basically, yep, the respective ca candle color is on each tent. So basically, whatever color the tent is, is the color of the candle that is. That should have already been pretty obvious, though. But yeah, looks beautiful, right? Huh? Oh, I don't think I lit these ones. There we go again. There goes that little tradition again where I always have to fix at least something in a video. But yeah, I know. Pretty crazy. And there's the most recent one, Rez. Until we get the Pi Day Dog on the 14th. And that can explain why the streamers are here, by the way. Yep, that literally can explain that. Of course, we'll take most of these guys in the future. I'm finally going to put Cake and Cool Cat 33 away after this. Um, before the next episode. Because, yeah, we've had them out for like two episodes now. And some of them aren't even here because they're with me. But yeah, looks beautiful, right? I really do hope you guys do love this anniversary party. Like, it took, I want to say 10 to 20 minutes. Yeah, I want to say like 10 to 20 minutes total to make this party. Again, it's a little mini event, so that is as expected for uh, this, genuinely. Because again, it's just like a one day mini event. Of course, it's going to only take like 10 to 20 minutes to uh, really make something like this. And uh, that's probably as expected. And um, last year around, we didn't have like the secondary staircase. Actually, last year. I don't think we even had the staircase last year, actually, for the previous anniversary. So that's new. Always for this year. But yeah, look at that. Looks pretty sweet, right? That's it. I have nothing else to say. So guys, with that being said... Thank you so much for watching this episode of Legos Island. Actually, I forgot to tell you that the candles are also in the water. Obviously, you can't light them up on the water, of course. But I forgot to mention one other thing about this. Again, all colored candles represented to each dog on not just the fountain, but also the cake. Leading all the way up to Raz. Anyway, with that being said, that is really cool. Anyway, guys, again, thank you so much for watching this episode of Legos Island. Uh, remember to like and subscribe, of course, because, yeah, it's beautiful. This party truly is cool. I don't know if it's even any better than the year prior. Point is, I hope you guys love it. And I'll see you all in the next episode on Friday, March 10th.